Hey there everyone, how is it going? Welcome back to the video guys and in today's video I'm going to be talking about this problem which you face in almost like every PXN view like if you have PXN V3 or PXN V9 or PXN V900 you would have faced this problem before where if you were to press your pedals they would register as buttons and basically your pedals would not work and if you were to press your pedals they would be registered on your PC as buttons. So before talking about that issue, there is something that you guys need to know if you have a PXN view. So you see guys, there are two input modes in this view. There is the X input mode and there is the direct input mode. So basically, uh, by default, when you turn on your computer, and you connect and you connect your vehicle to your computer the view is in the i think it's called the x input mode which is basically in that mode your steering wheel uh, acts like uh, an xbox controller and not really a view as you guys can see right now uh, my wheel is being registered as a controller and uh, basically the pedal would be working as a pedal but Right now the wheel is working as an Xbox controller and not really as a wheel. So to fix this issue you need to keep pressing, you see there is a mode button on your wheel. So you basically gotta keep pressing this for like I think 4 seconds until the light starts blinking. And now you guys can see our wheel is being registered as a steering wheel. And now if I uh, look inside the content manager for Corsa you can see that our wheel is now being registered as a wheel and not as a controller so right now if i were to press the pedals as you guys can see the pedals are working fine the accelerator and the brake both of the pedals are working fine and so the thing that i was talking about ooh, hold on a second guys and, oh, sorry. so yeah as you guys can see when i am pressing my pedals it's being registered it's being registered as an axis and not really as a button this is how it is supposed to work but now if i were to turn on steam just give it a second guys and now if i were to press the pedals you see nothing is happening guys i'm pressing the pedals right now but as you guys can see the pedals are being registered as buttons they're not being registered as pedals so basically steam is the cause of this issue whenever you turn on steam it fucks up the settings and then this thing happens where your pedals are not working as pedals and there's really like there's not really a fix to this issue even if you reinstall the drivers or you connect and disconnect your wheel you're still gonna face the same problem and the only thing that would work is that you just need to restart your computer so yeah i will just do that when i will restart my computer this problem will be fixed so i just restarted my computer and as you guys can see that my pedals have started working again now um which i was talking about earlier how do you play without steam fucking up your settings every single time what you gotta do is you wanna press Control, shift and escape and it's gonna turn on the task manager now as you guys know that whenever you turn on content manager and you start erasing content manager it's gonna boot up steam which is gonna cause the same problem again but as you guys know that when you turn on steam steam does this installation verification thing where basically steam is not fully turned on it's just verifying installation you have to turn off steam in that like two to three seconds you have because if you fail to do that in like 2 to 3 seconds, you're gonna fuck up your settings again and you have to restart your PC. So I will turn on Content Manager and I will keep an eye here for Steam. And as soon as I see Steam here, I'm gonna click on it and I'm gonna click on it and I'm gonna turn that thing off. I'm gonna turn that shit off. Okay, so now I will just turn on Content Manager. And now I'm gonna wait for it and Steam to start and as you guys can see I'm gonna click on cancel yeah that's all we have to do Steam is turned off, turned off and now if I go inside settings as you guys can see my pedals are working now also 
you gotta do the same thing when you start a race. Whenever I still can't go, Steam is gonna turn on again. And basically, you wanna see here for Steam. And you need to turn that thing off while it is verifying the installation. Because if that thing like, if that thing stays there for more than three seconds, it's gonna fuck up your settings and you will have to restart your PC again. So yeah, that's how you fix that issue, guys. And as I already told you guys, if you have Steam, if you have like a set of course uh, installed inside Steam and you basically cannot play without booting up Steam, then there is not really a fix for that because as I already said that I've searched up the whole internet for this issue, but like I have not found a single thread regarding this issue. And I've also checked the Steam settings to like maybe I will find something there, but no guys. 0% success so basically yeah what you can do is like if I keep pressing the mod button my my wheel is gonna like but now it's working as an xbox controller and if I were to press the pedals they're gonna work as the triggers on the controller which is gonna do the same thing as the race and brake pedals do and steam won't really mess up with these so if you play uh, in this xbox controller mode then it's alright, you can also play in Steam. But you cannot really play in the wheel mode with Steam. This is the only solution which I showed you guys. So yeah, that's it for today's video guys. If you like this video, please make sure to subscribe. And if you guys face any problem, feel free to tell me in the comment section below. And also if you like find a solution for this, also tell me in the comment section below and maybe I'll make a video on it so that everyone can know it and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video